How's it going, everybody? I am Jason of Jason's Realm here, and today I'm here bringing you guys my USFL Week 6 Power Rankings. Let's dive right into this. Before we do, I want to ask you guys a question. What do your Power Rankings look like? Let me know in the comments below, and I will respond to every single one of you guys who leaves a comment. At number 8, we have the Michigan Panthers falling three spots from last week, and man, this team has fallen off, haven't they? They were considered to be a top four team early, a top three team even, and now they find themselves at the bottom in the midst of their free fall. This team has been struggling and they have not been able to find a footing on either side of the ball as it stands. At number seven, we have the Birmingham Stallions also falling, but this time only by one spot. The Stallions looking all right, but not really the greatest, you know? Trying to see what they can muster, what they can do out of this, but they have not been able to do a thing about this the struggles that they've had. I mean, they've lost very winnable games for that unit, and they have not done a thing about it. At number six, we have the Philadelphia Stars up two spots from last week as they are actually starting to turn a corner once again. This team was looking good, but that win, oh man, that win really puts them in a good spot as that as they beat the Generals. Not quite great, but they are starting to turn that corner, and we'll see if they can keep going at this point. I mean, you know, one win, maybe start something, get some momentum going, and be hot. At number five, I have the Memphis Showboats also rising by two spots, and man, this team, they are turning a corner, are they not? They have gotten two wins, I think, in back-to-back -back weeks, if I'm not mistaken, or two in the last three weeks, something like that, and man, they are looking hot. This team is a scary team to face right now. They are finding their identities on both sides of the ball, and they are managing to stifle you. Their offense might not be the greatest, but they are finding ways to stifle the opposing offense when they need to. Number four, we have the New Jersey Generals falling by two spots this week as they did take a brutal loss to the Stars. This team really starting to hit that little bit of a struggle bus. I have not really been too, too high on them. They've been playing some decent football, but then they'll play like what the heck football and you don't know what they, you don't know what the true identity of the team is. That is my concerns with them. They can be a top team, but they can very well be a bottom team the very next week. There is no consistency with this team more so than any other team in the league. And number three, up one spot this week, is the Pittsburgh Maulers, as this team is finally getting it to click. They are starting to get the offense moving. The defense is still gelling. And man, this team is starting to turn into a contender. I think if that offense can get just a little bit more going, oh man, we are looking at a monster of a team going into the playoffs. And man, this team can be scared. Gary, if they can get something going, which I think they are starting to get it going. At number two, I have the New Orleans Breakers falling one spot after their loss to the Showboats. And man, this team, still 4-1, still in a great spot for playoffs. But man, that win has to be disheartening. That has to be like, that has to be like in the XFL, the defenders falling to the Guardians. I mean, it is just brutal to take that loss. But you know... You take it in stride and you see how you rebound next week. Maybe they find themselves number one if they rebound well. And that leaves your new number one team in the power rankings. The Houston Gamblers up by two from last week. And man, this team is starting to find their identity. And they are the hottest, hottest team in the league right now by far. And man, they got a matchup this week against New Jersey. I think that as long as they play just the way they've been playing, that is a very winnable game for that unit, considering how hot they are. Now, all streaks come to an end, but at the same time, I think that this team is starting to get it going, and they are starting to be something special. Well, that's about going to do it for me today. If you guys did like, don't forget to smash that like button. And if you haven't already, it helps me out a whole lot. Also, why not click that subscribe button? Something will be popping up over here in a little bit. Uh, we're trying to hit 400 by the start of the NFL season, which would be absolutely incredible. And also, go ahead and check out this video if you haven't already. It's one that YouTube thinks you should be watching. So we hope to see you over there. And I guess with that, I will see you guys later. Peace out and have a good one.